Hi guys, Ziggy Boogie Doo here with another video tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to enter DFU mode and re jailbreak your iPod, Touch, or iPhone if it's tethered and you accidentally turned it off or ran out of battery. So, what you want to do is you want to power it off. Oh, hold down the power button until the slider comes up. Next, what you want to do is you want to hold down the power button. And then when the Apple logo comes up, hold down the home button. Keep holding them both down until the Apple logo disappears and then you can let go of the power button. And uh, there should be a flash as you could see. That's when you let it go. Maybe wait two seconds afterwards. And once you hear connect to the computer, you can let go of the home button. And then it should be fine. Just going to switch over to the computer now and I'll show you how to do the rest of it. Right, guys, once your iPod or iPhone is in recovery mode, excuse me, DFU mode, you want to go into your Red Snow folder, mine is on the desktop here, and go into the actual program. Now, what you want to do here, it says my iPod's in DFU mode. You want to go to Extras. And then you want to go select IPSW. You might not need to do this in all cases, but in my mate's case you do. And you want to navigate to the folder where this is at. It should be in the same folder as Red Snow. You want to click open. It says it's going to use this for the rest of the session. Okay. And then you just want to click just boot. And if that goes well, then the iPod should be jailbroken once more. Should get to that, and if all went well, there should be a pineapple with a bite out of it on the screen of the iPod. Should say it's done here, and uh, it should boot up just fine. If it doesn't, you may need to try it several other times. Ah uh, well, okay, that worked fine, guys. So I guess I'll see you in the next video tutorial. Bye.